Students and parents normally dream of the day when their child's preparation for the college entrance exam will be over. Those students who do not get accepted into their dream schools usually choose to take the test over in hopes of getting a higher score. This is with the hopes of getting into a higher ranked school. Going back to high school or attending tutoring sessions are common for many of those who want to retake the test. The Chinese education system sets three years for high school education. So these repeat students are usually called grade four seniors. According to Beijing Youth Daily, the average tuition in Beijing has reached 20,000 renminbi, around $3,200 in recent years. According to the Ministry of Education, each year, more than 10 million students register for the college entrance examination. Nearly 30% of the students choose to stay back to retake the college entrance exam. The education industry has made billions of dollars because of the huge number of students looking to get ahead. Due to the huge profits behind this education market, most educational institutions, both high schools and tutorial centers, are making every effort to attract as many students as possible. One strange approach has been to hire students with high scores to retake the test. As News China reported, Guangfeng High School in Jiangxi, an eastern province in China, spends 1 million yuan, or around 160,000 U.S. dollars, every year on outstanding grade 4 seniors. The school even persuaded some students enrolled in college to go back. Assuming the students will earn a high test score that year, the school will improve its reputation and popularity. Chun Yitian is a student from Hangzhou in eastern China. He had continuously taken four years of college entrance examinations since 2007, and every time his score was about 600 out of 750 points. He finished with the top two highest scores at his high school each time. His highest score of 679 points helped him get entry into Renmin University, which is one of the top five universities in mainland China. However, he did not accept this offer and chose to return to the tutoring school again. Chen's experience as a four-time examinee became a trending topic online. He denied receiving money from the tutorial school he attended. But a local media source claims that the school has paid him around 150,000 renminbi, or around 24,500 U.S. dollars each year. This would be a normal salary for a recent graduate from college. It would actually be considered a pretty good salary, especially since there are so many unemployed graduates now. So the appeal of this salary before going to college is pretty high for such students, if their families aren't rushing to get them into college. Don't go away, because we'll continue to look at students being paid to go back to school. Stay tuned.